Hi guys, today I shall make my handy bandy soup. It's a secret recipe and I've never tried this before. I invented it. So what you need is, this is tomato and garlic sauce. I mean paste. This is beet paste and this is plain cabbage paste. But remember all of them contain water. This is on the gas. I lighted it myself. But let the water pour your first cabbage. Don't worry about pulling that means that happens. Don't you worry about that little thing. It's I'll not tell you what it is. Don't worry. Don't worry. Now put your beetroot paste. Tomato first, as you saw. And now final paste. Carrots. Use a wooden spatula. It's the best. Mix, 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 my new latest mishaps thing is a video. It's all about getting mishaps and you laugh and laugh. I've not made it though I've not made it yet. It will come soon. It is about cows and us too. That's another video of mine. This is what you need. Put it in. Give it a good stir. Another stuff. Put a dash of pepper from this side. That's enough. More than enough. Na 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 na. See, that's another mishap. Now, put some oregano. A little bit of turmeric. This is what you need. All in. Bring it to a boil and set it on a low flame. I love to set it on a too low flame flame because my gas doesn't like lows. It just turns off by itself. But it's not really off. Let it simmer for 10 minutes. But it's not done. Let it be for quite some time, but you have to stir. Put the remaining, you see. By the way, I forgot to tell you, you should, if there's a little less. Always. But be very careful when it's turning on. It might catch, it might catch fire. But I'm quite careful. That's why I did that. Just to take that soup. You can do this. You see? How it doesn't mix. It's boiling. Put it back on high. Mixed soup is almost ready. Squig it. I changed the name. Well, look at the wall. You just have to break the wall like this and your squeaky tea soup will be ready after some time. Let it simmer. Now, we shall now put the secret ingredients. Well, it's not secret. Cinnamon. Dash of cinnamon. That's quite a lot. That let it simmer. I still have to show you because I have to look at it like this. So this is a secret ingredient. <laughs> it 
looks like this. It's close to turmeric. That that's good. This is something that no one should know. My secret ingredient. I'm adding one more. That was the secret ingredient. No one knows. Hi guys. Hope you you just hope. By the way, you have to stir it. Bye guys. No need to stir up.